Now, U.S. President Donald Trump appears to have admitted defeat in his fight to push for a new Republican health care policy. With more on this and other news from around the world, we turn to our Noah Adam. So, Adam, after the collapse of the GOP bid to repeal and replace his predecessor's Affordable Care Act, Trump is now saying they should just let Obamacare fail and uh, start things off with a clean slate. That's right, Mark. The Republican leader in the Senate, Mitch McConnell, had vowed to hold a vote to only repeal Obamacare, but the plan withered within hours after three senators from his own party came out against it. A new health care bill was one of President Trump's key campaign pledges and would have seen him make a legislative triumph in his first six months in office if it had passed. Speaking at the White House, the president said he was not going to own it, adding that he was disappointed. We've had a lot of victories, but we haven't had a victory on health care. Uh, we're disappointed. I've been saying that, Mike, I think you'll agree for a long time. Let Obamacare fail. It'll be a lot easier. And I not only was a new health care bill a pledge by Trump, the GOP have been fighting to replace Obamacare for seven years now, but the party remains divided on its alternative. President Trump hoped that what he called the failure of Obama's signature legislation would result in Democrats calling for an alternative, but that doesn't look likely. Obamacare extended health insurance to 20 million more Americans, but Republicans say the law imposes too many costs on businesses and would result in lost jobs.